بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى اله وصحبه وسلم ما بعد اي الحبت في الله امام صالح بن فوزان حفظه الله تعالى وزاس وجد في هذا الزمان من يتعصب للاشخاص مع ان الحق خالفهم فرجاء توجيه كيف ننصح هؤلاء الشباب وجزاكم الله خيرا Imam Fuzan was asked, you find in this time those people who blind follow or have prejudice to specific personalities, even if the truth differs with them or they differ with the truth, please give us some direction and how should we advise those youth? and may Allah reward you with good. Imam Fuzan responded by saying, Hafizullah Ta'ala, Nunasahum an yata'allamu awlan, fuhum lam yata'asabu li ahad illa an jahl, fa'alayhim an yata'allamu al-ilm al-nafi' wa yatafaqu fi deen Allah, wa sa yatabayin lahum al-haq insha'Allah, amma ma damu juhalan, O muta'alimeen, fahada la yazeeduhum illa l-ikhtilafin, wa la yazeeduhum illa n-naza'in baynuhum. Imam Fuzan responded by saying, Hafidhullah Ta'ala, he said, we advise them that they should learn first. For verily, they only have this partisanship or this blind following to individuals due to their ignorance. So it is upon them to learn beneficial knowledge and to gain understanding of the religion of Allah. And then it will become clear to them the truth, insha'Allah. As for as long as they remain ignorant or they claim to have knowledge, then this will only increase them in differing and it will only increase them in their differing amongst themselves or argument, argument, uh, arguing amongst themselves and we ask Allah the Almighty to protect us from Hizbiyah and protect us from being those who claim knowledge or claim piety and may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless us all with ilm al-nafi wa rizqan tayyib wa amal al and make light and goodness between our hearts and protect our ummah from continually arguing, arguing and having ikhtilaf be, between them. And may Allah unite the hearts of Ahl al-Sunnati wal Jama'ah so that we do not continue to attack one another in one another's honor and destroy one another at the expense of our own religion. And may Allah forgive us of our many sins. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyya Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.